Adam here from DirectionTrader.com. Going to show a quick uh, uh, recap of today's trades, and then uh, basically the the reason of this video is to show the difference between a Fibonacci retracement setup and a Fibonacci extension setup. I took one of each today. Um, today is the first day after Martin Luther King Day, and um, it was a little bit indecisive on on what the market actually wanted to do. So there's only two two trades in the in the trading room today. Uh, one in the ES and one in the Euro. So. Um, basically, here in the ES, we've been waiting on this ambush or halfway back trade to fill its target up here at um, 1485 quarter. It has not done that yet. What it's done, it's came within a point and then it's pulled back until now. It made this another micro, I guess a, a smaller ambush to the long side. We're waiting for it to fill that. So today I was only taking longs unless this smaller structure was actually broken, which it wasn't. So at 641, I went long two contracts, got plus two off for the first contract. After it moved up and retested the previous highs of the swing, I had moved my stop to my entry. And if you notice up here, my target, the green dashed line, negative 23%, I came within a tick of it. I front run it by one tick, so my target was at 1481.75, and it came to 1481.50. Just luckily, you know, I got my first off. I moved my second contract up to my entry, waited for that move. The news came out at seven o'clock, and you see what happened. So, instead of taking a full profit, I went one tick from my target and came around, got stopped out for a twenty-five dollar profit. That happens in trading. Um, I should have. Uh, I probably should have just taken profit before the news, but I really thought I would have hit it before it actually came out. I was within a tick of my profit uh, six minutes before the news, so that them, them kind of things just happen in uh, trading. Uh, just gotta take your legs and move on. But that is a perfect example of a Fibonacci retracement in the direction of the longer structure or the longer trend, whatever you want to say, call it. Uh, let's go over and show you a Fibonacci extension and why you would take an extension versus a Fibonacci um, uh, uh, retracement. Um, this is Euro. It's a little bit choppy, so we're taking we're looking at intraday uh, scalps or smaller trades. Um, at this time, I happen to be taking the ES trade, and um, I did not like the short side, so I did not trade this Euro short. But once it started to show me some structure. Uh, what I mean by that is it had a Fibonacci trade set up and completed its target perfectly. So then, once again, it did the same thing, completed its target perfectly. But what happened here was it blew through its target. I'm, I'm sorry, I did not mean to say it, it completed it perfectly because it didn't turn around once it hit the negative 23%. It blew through this dashed green line, which is the profit taking. That's when Fibonacci extensions come into play. I showed this live in the trading room. I was trying to, there was a couple new guys. They didn't quite understand what I was doing. Basically, if the market retraces and you enter and it, and it, and it blows through the negative 23%, then you're looking for lows to low. So in this example, we drew this Fib from this low here all the way down to this low. And the same rules apply to this so we entered on the 50 percent and shorted so rather than waiting for the full swing which would have been this we entered an extension because of the way this thrust down through the negative 23 percent so we entered short right here we got our plus plus two and then we were just trailing it down and we got five more ticks out of it so plus seven for 87.50 two tiny trades in the uh in the trading room today Nothing too crazy. I didn't want to get too wild because of uh, this is the first day after a holiday. So it was a little bit indecisive early, and then it came around to uh, finally pan out. But two trades um, just showed you one example of a regular Fibonacci retracement and then an example of when to take a Fibonacci extension. So if you have any questions, go ahead and come by the live trading room at directiontrader.com. We trade uh, Fibonaccis every single day and uh, as well as other strategies. So come by, check us out, directiontrader.com. Take me up on a trial that we offer. So I will see you there. Have a good day.